estoy creciendo dos nietos con difíciles dificultades por el agüita para manejar los aseados. Y un día, y un día que yo a lavar, me pongo a darle vuelta a la bomba y caí desmayada al, al suelo porque ya no aguantaba la fuerza de la bomba. Entonces yo ahora me siento muy feliz por este líquido que los, que los han traído ustedes. Me consiento muy contenta por tenerlas a ustedes acá, que, que los van a dejar un poco feliz de la vida por lo principal, que es el líquido, el agua, que lo necesitamos a cada momento. I grew up in Honduras and I went to the United States five years ago. I thought that joining this organization I could impact the lives of where I grew up or the community that I saw had struggles the most. The reason we started this club was so that we could apply what we've learned in a classroom setting on to real world experience. As the days have gone by with the brigade and like what Marco is teaching us, a lot of it we learn in school so it's really great to apply what we learn in school into a project. My name is Marco Landa. I'm the program lead for this new engineering brigade. We work on empowering students by demonstrating and implementing our methods for assessing a community for a water project, talking with community members about what access they have to water, types of jobs in the community, distances they travel, and the risks they face while getting the water. You really have to think about what materials you're going to use, what manpower, how you're going to transport everything to that area. So it really makes you think outside the box. And students evaluate potential water sources based on the location, type of system needed, and the flow rate the source has. Students collect data then by mapping community houses and its potential distribution network. We have been doing calculations uh, with regards to the water system that we were going to be installing. We have been mapping the area. The sites of the water source and where the tank would be set and along the streets of where the pipelines were going to go. Knowing about the different diameters, the different kind of pipes that need to be used, I think that's definitely something that students are able to um, apply here on the Engineering Brigade project. Engineering Brigades also play a pivotal role in follow-up for past water systems by testing pH and chlorine levels of the previous water project. And on this, it puts aside the money, you know, it puts aside everything else, and it just leaves the willing to do it to help out somebody else's life. When you come here and you see the necessities these people face, and with engineering, we can make an impact. By having student volunteers come to Honduras as critical thinkers, communities have access to the technical insights and efforts that will bring potable water to their homes in the future.